Calling all parents, grandparents, families, teachers, social workers, therapists, and supporters of youth. Anxiety, depression, suicide, loneliness, fear, drugs, and alcohol, human trafficking, and sexual immorality are just a few of the enemies which attack our youth daily. Let's go to war on their behalf through prayer. Join Elder John Amanchukwu with Parents in Prayer every first and third Wednesday at 6 a.m. The new conference call number is 351-888-6425 and an access code is not required. I was glad when they said unto me, let us go into the house of the Lord. If you are in or visiting the Raleigh area and looking for an opportunity to gather with the saints for a God-first experience, the Upper Room is pleased to offer two services every Sunday morning. Join us at 8 a.m. and 11 a.m. for Sunday worship service in the sanctuary. You can also join the Upper Room Church of God in Christ every Sunday at 11 a.m. and Thursdays at 7.30 p.m. for the live stream of our services on Facebook Live and YouTube Live. Bishop Patrick L. Wooden Sr. will bring a fresh word from the Lord relevant to our times and equip you to contend for the faith. Thank you to our viewers throughout the United States and abroad for your weekly support of our broadcast. We are calling all of the K-12 youth worshiping servants who worship God to join our youth pastor, John Amanchukwu, every Wednesday at 7 p.m. for Youth Bible Study. He will continue in the series, Faith That Works, and will minister from James 4. Please send an email to gn at powooden.org to receive the Zoom link and be sure to share it with a friend. The Upper Room Church of God in Christ continues to abide by CDC social distancing guidelines. Our ushers will seat all individuals entering the sanctuary and overflow areas. Only members from the same immediate family will be permitted to sit together, and everyone will be seated using designated markings providing a six feet diameter around each area. Additionally, temperature checks and hand sanitizing protocols have been added to further promote measures of safety. A hand sanitizer containing at least 60% alcohol will be provided and is required for entry. Your cooperation is greatly appreciated. For additional information on face covering requirements in North Carolina, visit nc.gov. Please be reminded there are several ways to give to the Upper Room Church of God in Christ. For online giving, please visit easytithe.com forward slash URC. Also, please use only one email address for each Easy Tithe account so we can properly track your giving. You may also visit our website, upperroomgospel.org and select the giving tab. Or you can mail your gift to the Upper Room Church of God in Christ, Post Office Box 447, Garner, North Carolina, 27529. First-time text to give users can text URC Give to 45777 and you will receive a link to complete your giving. If you have used text to give before, you can simply enter the amount and fund. For example, $25 tithe to 45777. As always, thank you very much for supporting the Upper Room Church of God in Christ. The proud parents, Mr. and Mrs. Reginald Scarborough, request the honor of your presence at the wedding ceremony of their daughter, Raven Shade Scarborough, and Joshua Alexander Garrison, son of Miss Gretchen Williams. The celebration will be held Saturday, May 1st at 2 p.m. here at the Upper Room Church of God in Christ. Be sure to save the date for the Psalm Friday series, the first Friday night destination for NC youth and young adults, to be held Friday, May 7th at 7 p.m. here at the Upper Room. Everyone is invited to join Bishop Patrick L. Wooden Sr. for the 5th Ministers and Workers Meeting of NC 3rd, Qualified Worshiping Servants, to be held Wednesday, April 21st through Friday, April 23rd here at the Upper Room. Get ready for powerful day sessions and night services, which will highlight the ministers, elders, and missionaries of the NC 3rd jurisdiction. Thursday, April 22nd will be Women's Day, and there will be training sessions designed for women, along with a powerful word from evangelist Crystal Amanchukwu. Additionally, sessions for the men will take place via Zoom with a special guest you don't want to miss. This powerful gathering will also include life-changing messages from our jurisdictional chief of staff, Superintendent Tommy Quick on Wednesday evening, and our jurisdictional supervisor, Mother Beverly Dijonet, on Thursday evening. The week will conclude with the mighty word from our jurisdictional prelate, Bishop Patrick L. Wooden Sr. Prepare yourself for a jurisdictional revival.